Hello everyone, I'm Emily Flores. Welcome to the Blue Zone. And I'm here with head coach Richard Salee of the Varsity Wrestling Team, along with Elijah Anthony. So, coach, what do you expect from the team this season? Um, we, we do have some team goals. We want to be successful in our tournaments, our dual meets. We've, we started our season off 6-0. and uh, We had a rough match uh, on Tuesday this week uh, against Western Boone, and I don't want to take anything away from Western Boone, but I don't feel like we wrestled at our... Our, our top level. We have goals of winning county and conference and uh, placing hopefully in the top three or four of the sectional. Um, but the biggest thing we have is, is we, a few years ago we came up with a credo that we want our wrestlers to live by. Um, it's that they're thankful for the opportunity to wrestle, um, that they have no fear of losing or making mistakes. Um, they're relentless in their attack, in their offense, and they never ever give up. And our main concentration is that we stick to that and all the other goals are going to take care of themselves. That's good. So what are your overall outlook on your wrestlers this season? You know, we, returning Elijah, who, uh, you know, went to the state finals and is currently ranked fifth is, is one uh, thing that is a positive to look forward to, but we have a lot more people to, to look at other than that. We have a lot of newcomers. Um, we have people joining him that were regional qualifiers or semi-state qualifiers last year. Uh, Jose Batista, semi-state qualifier. Uh, Christian Matias, one of our seniors, was a, a regional qualifier. Um, Diego Nava is a huge leader for us. And then we have a few kids that um, took a year off and came back and joined us as seniors that are, 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 could make a splash. Um, and then we got some newcomers. Coach Byers joining our staff helped. He, he brought some football players with him that are going to make a difference once they learn some basics. But uh -huh. we really think that we can make some noise as, as we move through the first half of the season and get into the postseason. That's good. So how many kids do you think will advance to regionals this year? <laughs> That's a hard question. Uh, last year was uh, probably one of our best, I know it was the best year since I've been back. I've been back for 15 years. Um, we, we advanced four to the regional. I'd love to take seven or more. I think it's possible. That's good. Thank you, Coach. We'll be right back after the break with Elijah Anthony. Everyone needs to be a part of something. If not girls golf, find something. Frankfort High School provides plenty of opportunities for you to be a part of, including 19 sports and plenty of clubs. Be sure to get involved. I'm here with Elijah Anthony, sophomore, 113 pounder. Elijah is currently ranked fifth in the state and is a returning state qualifier. So Elijah, how well do you think your teammates are going to do this season? I think we're going to do really well because we went 5-0 at the conference duels and we beat Western Boone, so we already have them. We got Lebanon Saturday. I hope we win against them. If so, we'll be 7-0 on conference duels and we should be ranked like first in conference duels, so I hope we can do that and win conference and hopefully win county next week. That's good. So. What are your personal goals this season? First, my goal is to get on the podium for state because last year I was turning state qualifier and I hope to do better this year, which is place state. And to win sectionals, regionals, because I'm the highest ranked there. So I hope I can win sectionals and regionals. And to get 175 takedowns and not let a guy touch my leg 20 times. <laughs> so how do you think you're going to achieve these goals this season well it's working with my coaches if I don't imp talk to my coaches I won't know what to work on because they're the coach and I'm the wrestler and they know what to do and it's to stay after practice and do extra stuff with partners like Armando Roa, Josue Bautista, Juan Campos all of them so to work together do you think working together helps more on your side? Yes, because we can learn from each other. Thank you for joining us on the Blue Zone. I'm Emily Flores from the Hot Dog Network. Until next time.